And then we have these, which I actually really love. But, um, yeah, they're pretty broken, and the whole sole was, like, off, and I glued it back on. But, um, that being said, I thought they were broken worse than they actually are. <laughs> so now I'm, like, indecisive, because, actually, I tried to fix them, obviously. Decided to try and fix them and wear them, you know, one more round, you can say. But, and so I sorted. As you can see, the glue... <laughs> And, um, um, but I think I can get this off with, like, nail polish remover. But, you know, I don't know. I feel like my shoe collection, like, so-called collection, like, pile of shoes, was just so big. And I just, due to the fact that I had to reduce, I kind of said to myself, you know what, just, like, leave it. Like, I mean, anyone whose shoes are that broken would just dump them, like. <laughs> but then, I don't know, seeing them now, they're actually um, worse in my memory. Then they actually are in real life. So if I just got another packet of glue and did the same thing, made sure, you know, I take this off, the glue, the nail polish remover even, or even like this. Yeah, or like this, you know, that works too. Um, I didn't know you could do this. Anyway, it's just I love them. They're really expensive when you apparently, but I got them from, off eBay. And this lady had told me how hard and painful they were at the beginning they were really hard and painful but i think they just took extra long to be broken in and i did that so like <laughs> jokes on you you shouldn't have sold them to me you could have done that yourself but i thought she just liked me and i'm like oh no she didn't tell me they're so painful so after doing the end of the leather it's, it's so thick and the shoe guy shoe store guy who repairs the shoes actually like sat um you know that that's really good leather and I buy really good things. <laughs> um, everyone loves love them, even my like, Pakistani friends. Love them. But, and I thought.